Hi, my name is Amit Desai and I welcome you to Lightroom Preset Shop. In this video, I am going to show you how to make the most out of local adjustment presets or brush presets. The very first thing that we need to understand is what are local adjustment brush presets. As the name suggests, these are effects that you can selectively brush over onto certain areas in the image that need to be corrected or enhanced. The main difference between developed presets and brush presets is that the application of developed presets is global as opposed to the application of the brush presets which is local and selective in nature. Now that you know what local adjustment brush presets are, we need to understand how to install these presets and we have a separate video purely on how to install Lightroom brush presets or local adjustment brush presets and I would suggest you to go through that video so that you can install local adjustment brush presets onto your computer as well. In order to access all the local adjustment presets or the brush presets, there are three tools that give way to using these presets. And these three tools are adjustment brush tool, this is the radial filter tool, and then we have the graduated filter tool. In our example, let's try out the adjustment brush tool. And here if you see the current preset that is active or the effect that is active is the temperature preset or the effect. If you want to change that or if you want to have a look at all the different effects that are available to you at any given point in time in Lightroom, then all you need to do is simply click on that effect which is active and you will find a drop down of all the effects that are available to you which are brush presets. Now let us in our example to enhance the eyeliner of the beautiful lady, let us use this preset, the eyeliner preset. And now that we have this preset selected you will immediately see that there are certain adjustments automatically done which is a preset which is a combination of all these different sliders and now when I hover over the image and simply brush over I am only enhancing or editing or affecting a certain local aspect of the photo in our case the eyeliner. Now if you find that this effect is a little too strong to your liking or maybe if it is too less to your liking what you need to do is simply click on this triangle and what you get is singular slider which is a composite of all the different effects so you are averaging out all the effects that you made as a preset and now just by sliding this one slide to the right you are enhancing or increasing the intensity of the eyeliner preset and if you slide that to the left then you are reducing the intensity of that preset so this is how you can increase or decrease the intensity of a particular brush adjustment onto your photograph. So why are brush presets important? Let me tell you my friend the most important secret of all the biggest and the most greatest photographers, the professional photographers in the world and that is they use brush presets very wisely and very intelligently in all of their editing workflow. In fact, if I were to tell you, I truly believe that brush presets or the local adjustment presets is the secret sauce that you can use to take your photographic imagery to a whole new level and I promise that. So why are brush presets important? Brush presets are important because they help you to fine tune and tweak an image. They help you to add artsy touches to images. They help you to create drama and special effects. They also help you to balance the image using dodging and burning techniques. They are excellent for beauty, fashion, skin and hair retouching. And they also help you to enhance and conceal certain details in the image. Now if you want to understand how all of this can be done, we have a separate video wherein I actually demonstrate to you how you can use this amazing brush presets that we sell, these brush presets and how you can use them to do skin retouching, to do high-end fashion skin retouching on fashion models, to brighten the teeth, to just simply retouch the skin, the hair, add some makeup, reduce few blemishes or conceal some wrinkles and a lot of things can be done. 
and you can even add special effects like you can for example you can even do special effects like you can add light inside of this so that it appears to be uh, glowing and you can give the effect that it's twilight time and you can completely make over this whole image into a completely different experience we will see every single thing that i promise to you in the next video that is on local adjustment brush presets so keep yourself posted for that this is going to be a very exciting video because it will give you a complete picture of how you can harness the power of brush presets in your editing workflow and create extraordinary professionally great looking works of art thanks for watching bye for now and i look forward to seeing you in the next video mm -hmm.